Greetings everybody. Welcome back to my channel and to my garden. I'm checking on the garden and I just want to take you along with me to spend a lazy afternoon in the garden. It is July the 4th in America, uh, Independence Day. So I'm going to start right here and have some ghost peppers. See how they're turning red? Look at these. Beautiful, beautiful ghost peppers. These used to be the hottest peppers in the world, Nathan. Did you know that? No. These are ghost peppers. They are so, so hot. And when harvesting peppers, it is better to cut than to pluck them from the branch. That's all of these ghost peppers. It's a good idea to wear gloves when handling peppers, but I will have to wash my hands after this. So these are my ghost peppers, and they're just pretty. They're pretty, right? Yeah. Yes? All right. Now let's go check on uh, Nathan's peppers. These are the Carolina Reapers that my son Nathan started from seeds. Okay. There's some over there and some behind there. So follow me. Peppers. Yes. These are the Carolina Reapers that my son and I started from seeds. As you can see, they are blooming, blossoming, blooming. I don't know what the word is, but they produce flowers. And that means very soon, okay, this one has no flowers. This one has no flowers. But it means that soon we are going to get peppers from here and they used to be like way over there which was really exposed to the sun so I moved it to this corner where it's partly shaded and hopefully we should not experience a lot of blossom drops I'm really hopeful that we'll get peppers from here and some okras these are country okra there's one here and we'll harvest this one as well. Let me tell you about these peppers I'm about to harvest. I call them Papa's peppers. And that's because these peppers were given to me by my dad. He grew these peppers in the village in Dinka. That's where my ancestors are and he was so passionate about growing. He is still passionate, but right now his health is not the best, so he's not doing gardening. But when I visited him a couple of years ago, maybe six years ago, he gave me these dehydrated peppers to come and use in uh, cooking. And I have saved the pepper things. I don't know, they're so precious to me. And every year I try to grow the peppers and they will not grow. This year, the peppers germinated from seeds and let me just show you how beautiful they are. Look, these are papa's peppers. have some yellow and some red some ghost peppers it's so pretty All right. 